Hey people, hey everyone, so welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in this video episode, we continue our theme about Squarespace. So actually, this is a website builder. I assure you it will be very interesting for you if you are interested in design, UI UX design, if you want to create uh, your personal website just in 15 minutes. So uh, this video is going to be for you. So let's start our review about Squarespace. So, um, people, what I can say, um, Squarespace is ideal for creating professional websites and it has the best quality designs and features on the market. And you know, while it can take a little bit used to, the final results are worth your patience. So I highly recommend it for those who care about design, UI UX design, or have a bit of technical skill. So um, let's start to check templates because, uh, you know, Squarespace has many beautiful and gorgeous templates. And of course, it has many categories and subcategories, so we can check them from online store to real estate properties. We have memberships, photography, local business restaurants. So let's start from the membership to just to check um, templates. Um, and this is the first one uh, blog. Pop we have the categories Lasaka. So let's start. Let's check this preview uh, and I can say that, you know, Squarespace plans start at $12 per month. So the website uh, builder offers many templates and they are easily adapted to mobile devices. And uh, the custom we ha you have right here support live chat service and is very strong. So actually Squarespace doesn't currently offer phone support but the only thing uh, about the phone which is very nice this is the application but about this application we will talk a little bit later uh so what we have what we got right here this is actually the preview uh we can check full um demo uh so actually i adore uh templates and all the content is my favorite part actually observing the templates is my favorite part you know because um here we can um, actually see the structure or we can check the content and the images which are high, with high quality yep uh, all the bottoms, all the sections. So for me, it's very interesting because I'm interested in UI as design. But you know, if you don't have the um, the experience, for example, of uh, the design, so don't be so nervous. You can practice practice right here, and you can also really be web designer. Why not? So basically, I'm doing right now a review. It's not. I. It's just like you know, my videos are between tutorials, so between um between reviewing videos because you know I'm not a professional at this sphere uh, for me it's like a part of hobby and you know uh, I also work uh, uh, with uh, these website builders and you know I try to combine uh, my work with hobby and I enjoy uh, it so basically uh, right here what, what I can tell you about we have uh, three um, adaptive designs and I can show you them directly right here so this is basically the desktop version this is for a tablet and we can check the borders are shorter um, and here we have just skin you know a uh, website which is for mobile phones so basically we can start with this design or let's check um, the other one so for example this pink one and for me it's very interesting because i guess that here is not um images so basically we have only in background and content but without images and the same this is the mobile phone for version yeah this is for the tablet and this is for <clears throat> for the desktop so let's watch the view uh, the full uh, demo and that is how it looks like so pink very nice uh, exactly for me because I adore pink color so we have icons of social accounts so that is how you can, we can uh, work with um, this design. So I guess that we will start with this template, even if it doesn't uh, actually um, have uh, any images. Let's try, why not? And basically we have the bottom, start with this design and clicking directly to this bottom. Uh, we will work right now directly with the editor. 
So um, before working with any editor, we have um, the main menu section, many tools, I would say, uh, right here on the left side. Uh, and actually, let's check each menu section. So basically, the page are responsible for the layout, what sections, how many sections we got. We can uh, add some sections. This is the main navigation. So basically, we can add some blocks, portfolios, some links, it may be, or events. So that is this section is responsible for this one um so right now i try to show you what you can uh what you will see uh right here this course case editor uh we are not uh, building a site it's just a reviewing part of um, this video so um uh, the next uh, section is about it design so basically this section is um, responsible for phones colors uh, some checkout pages uh, some icons yeah browser icons um, social sharing and other so basically we can change fonts right here we can change color of the fonts size um i would say the font yep actually uh, we can change heading paragraphs add some bottoms but basically you know uh, actually i forgot to tell you that um, this is not drag and drop editor this is editor in i would say it's about much more straightforward than the other than the lead pages and the than the wix and it looks like in wordpress for me okay uh so we got right here animations we can add some animations right here but we have right now none of the animations so we can got spacing bottoms some image blocks so basically that is how you can um, change uh, some elements yep so about the marketing this is very interesting because you know so basically i can say that it's possible to launch right here a mail advertising and right now we have uh, right here a mail campaigns you can add some automated mailings according to pre-prepared uh, letter layouts and scripts so basically you can uh, create everything right here but you know uh, everywhere we have zero because this is a template so uh, never mind on it so this is about the CEO section the CEO is very strong also right here uh, we have uh, CEO navigation I would say we have checklists but if you don't like to if you don't want actually to be responsible at CEO task you don't know you are in no use at this sphere so you can hire a CEO expert and this CEO expert will uh, do your work uh, so I'm uh, checking the next what we got right here uh, of course uh, promotional we can uh, add some pop-ups some announcement bars some even Instagram stories Pinterest on Facebook, I mean, we can, I would say, add uh, social accounts to our website. That is, uh, I would say, for today's must have. Uh, talking about the analytics, uh, the next section, I can say that analytics uh, is really powerful and multi level. It includes statistics on sales, traffic, geography, everything we got right here, but everywhere is zero because this is a template. But you can search some keywords, you can do some uh, popular content, and you can even um, create activity logs. So, everything, everything is right here so you need to practice a little bit more information to understand what it is but you will got it when you will create your personal website uh, because you will um, mix your theory and you will mix it with your practice so actually that is how it works and i guess that we continue we will um work right now directly with um, the editor um, you know talking about the pros talking about the advantages uh, right here in Squarespace I can tell only that it has a stunning templates which are optimized for desktop um, for the tablet uh, for the mobile devices it has a mobile app and this uh, mobile app is really nice thing because you know you don't work with your laptop 24 7 so but you have 
24 per 7, uh, per 7 with you, your personal mobile phone. So basically via your mobile phone, you can uh, add uh, anything what you want directly right here uh, in your side with the help of this first case app or change some something so that is for you and of course the ability to restore uh, detailed posts and pages for up to 30 days uh, so and of course uh, scores case I can tell that is great for photographers for green novices who like to uh, continue their life and mix their life with um with the UI UX design yeah with the IT I would say some knowledges and of course uh, for people who would like to represent themselves right here with the help of this website so this is really option for you to try so and basically uh, we got right here uh, our template this is our site so we have sections header the next one, the third one, we have the content and basically uh, the footer right here. So uh, you can check that here we um, actually these are uh, this template is divided into the sections and uh, it's not like in Wix or lead pages. Basically, Wix with Wix pages are uh, Wix pages Wix uh, website builder service. Um, as you know, uh, drag and drop it is where basically you right there can uh, drag some elements. Yeah, you know, but here uh, it's uh, not like in this way. It's much more, I would say, uh, straightforward. Yep, and here we work directly with each element, with each section. So uh, clicking directly to uh, the header. Yep, we have the settings right here. So basically, they are. Um, I would say we can uh, work simultaneously, of course, with um, uh, three versions for with the mobile, uh, for the desktop, and of course for the tablet. So we can upload the logo if we have. We can change size, type to logo we can add some elements for example from well the elements i can um delete a bottom yeah or just add social link um and uh we have uh, colors for example and i can make it transparent so basically it be in this way or this way so basically we have some uh some sections the other one some types uh, of uh, this uh, headers but uh, I've chosen light bulb and let it be right here the light bulb so the next one uh, by the way between each section we have the bottom to add section so basically click into this bottom we have what we have uh, settings and uh, we can add whatever from this list so from the headlines uh, till the pricing basically we got list again you get gallery uh, we can add some quotes for example it may be calendar uh, FAQS or location or logo wall or menu the other one or just pricing whatever you want it depends on you and your product how you can see and how you would like to represent it so the next one clicking directly to um, I would say to the element to the text uh, right here so it looks like in WordPress so you can choose some variants uh, some um, options what you got right here and what looks better for your site so basically uh, that is what I told you about it's much more straightforward you don't drag and drop some elements you only work with the, the menu and what this menu um, proposes to you so you uh, work directly with uh, with that what you got right here or you can successfully delete it and just click into the um, garbage bin design uh, so um, the next what we got uh, so the same my mission that is what you would like to add basically right here also we have uh, a menu uh, so um, here we can the menu on the section and we can uh, remake it I would say so we can change the format uh, we have small medium large so that is how that is how it looks small that is how it looks medium and that is how it looks enlarged so I mean the distance between uh, between the sections is getting bigger um, so I will left I will save all in small yep um, the next we can change the location yep right here here 
or this way or more this way or just more this way so basically it depends on what you see and what you will choose so we, you can upload to uh, the background the image and let's do the same or you can or just uh, for example we can change um, the background yep we can make it right here white um oh uh, it's better or make it black gold or just pink okay i don't want to upload the um image so let uh, all lots of like in uh white color okay so the next section all the same uh for example we can uh the same play with the background and change it to the to this one so yeah and we got sections so the next one what we got right here the same small medium large let it be small positions so basically the alignment and of course um the summary so we can delete it or we can um <laughs> to, to add some uh settings about the content and how it will look like so the next one what we got right here all the same uh all the same so basically if you like to change the text that you click directly to the text and you get many of this text and you change how you check it how you see it, how you imagine it and just mm, in this method you can choose uh, the variant that you like the most like here also the same or just check uh check or just change the section yeah and the next one is the footer so basically we can add in the footer yeah and uh, clicking directly to the bottom of editing the footer we uh, got actually all the same stuff right here or here and here or just clicking directly to designs we can change this design I and mean design it may be in the center it may be in the right so it may be in the left right here yeah it may be regular or just like this one with the border or just like this one or 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 in a cloud <laughs> let's check or or like this one so basically that is how you can work i can say for uh for the end uh, because this is the end of our video reviewing video uh, i could say that you know the squarespace interface is stylish of course it's attractive of course it's but it's you know sometimes uh, most of time i would say this way it operates at medium speed unfortunately and has um equally medium of level of ergonomics you know there are a lot of animations uh there are a lot of right here graphics uh, some uh, tricks but you know in some places all this uh does not combine well and affects the usability so i guess that this is uh you know a disadvantage but you know um squarespace has a handy intuitive visual page editor so um you can work here intuitive uh, so thank you for your attention. I'm waiting for your personal opinion. What do you think about Squarespace? Have you tested it or not? Or maybe you prefer the other website builder service. And I guess we will see each other in another video episode. Don't forget to click your like, subscribe to my channel and see ya. Bye.